and welcome to another Mimosa in the Field video. Today, special episode talking about B24 tips and tricks, mounting and alignment. So for those of you who haven't watched the first B24 video, please go watch that first. For those of you that have watched it, then you're in the right spot. So there's been a few people who've come in to chat, community, other places who've said they've had trouble with their mounts. It's mainly this problem right here where you can see it's real loose you know, it basically moves back and forth. And I'm gonna talk about how to fix that real quick. So you need your Allen wrench and your 10 millimeter. So let's go ahead and uh, stick our Allen wrench in here. And we're gonna go ahead and tighten this down. And once you tighten it down, it doesn't move anymore. It's, it's solid. So now we're gonna go ahead and uh, tighten this down here so you guys can see. And now it doesn't move back and forth anymore. Another thing that has been talked about is that the B24 spins on the pole. But this only happens when you're using a pole that's smaller diameter than what's recommended. So Mimosa recommends at least a one and a half inch outer diameter or OD pipe. This is uh, about one and three quarter. So as you can see, it's simply not turning at all. And if you're using something smaller than a one and a half, you probably need to do a standoff with a two inch piece of pipe. And uh, one more thing, LE lock one and LE lock two, if you wrench these down really hard, it's going to move your radio. It's gonna throw it off maybe 10 dB, depending on how short or long distance it is. So I'm gonna loosen these up here just a little bit, just enough where I can adjust the elevation. You can see the, the elevation here moving back and forth. And then you just want to kind of slowly tighten LE2 up just a little bit. Come up here to LE lock one and again, be real gentle with it. It doesn't have to be super tight either because it's not going to go anywhere. So, now this is tightened up. I didn't wrench down on it and it should be perfectly where you had it aligned before. Same with left and right. Tighten this down using both the Allen wrench and the 10 millimeter. You'll be good to go. You don't have to tighten this down and you don't have to tighten this one down, but you can. Just remember to loosen it back up if you need to align it again. And so that's it for this episode, guys. So again, if you need help, feel free to visit our support page, uh, open up a chat, uh, send us an email, or go to YouTube and look up some videos because we've covered quite a bit of material in the field. And so we'll see you next time on our next field video.